What is up guys? Welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm playing Star Trek Online, a game I've been dying to play. Um, as you all know, my name is Datalore Videos and that has a little Star Trek background to it. Um, I'm what you might call a Trekkie. I mean, I'm not like a full Star Trek fan, but I like Star Trek. I usually am watching Star Trek most of the time. So when I heard about this game, I was dying to play it, but I couldn't play it because I had to get a new computer. But now that I have a new computer, I can finally play this game. So what we're going to do today is we're going to do, this video is just mostly going to be my customization of my character, my choosing of my class, and then maybe a bit of the intro, and after that, the video is going to stop, and then the next video will be when I get into the main gameplay. So I'll be doing some let's plays. I'm not going to do any walkthroughs because I haven't yet played this game. I'm going to do let's plays like a whole gameplay through the whole until up to level, I believe it's level 60, I believe. I, if, if I'm wrong, let me know in the comments down below, but I'm pretty sure it's level 60. So we're going to be playing this game through I mean, everything, pretty much everything, the, the main story content. Um, I'm going to be playing as a federation. And let's get started choosing our character. We have an Andorian. We have a human. We have a Bajoran. We have a Benzite. We have a. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, wait, no. Okay, this is Betazoid, okay. We have a Bolian. We have a Ferengi. We have a. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. We have different species. We have a. a Trill. A Vulcan, an alien. I think I'm gonna. From what I read, alien is better because you get to pick your own thing. So let's go with alien. We're gonna go for engineer. Let's see, engineer, stability support, generators, and control the path. Yada 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 yada. Engineer. I mean science officer. Tactical officer. So tactical officer is like your guy who does a lot of damage but has low shield and health. Science officer think is your tank? I'm I'm not sure. I, I don't know, I'm not gonna say anymore. Um I'm gonna go for engineering. Let's go. Wait, what wait, I didn't pick <laughs> I didn't pick a gender. <laughs> I have a female race. Let's do male. Okay. Let's do alien. Don't wanna get that wrong. Okay. Okay, so let's see my appearance. Let's see, head. Humanoid. You know what? Slow it down. I think I want to go with a Vulcan. Let's do that instead. Let's see. Nope. No. You know what? Let's do head overall size. Let's do there. Overall head height. Whoa. <laughs> okay, that's the big head height. Let's go right about there. Skull height. Let's go down about there. Cranial width. There. Mm hmm. I think we'll leave all this. I think we'll leave that there. Eyes, eye size. I think that's good. Eye position. There, eye depth. I don't see much difference. Nose position, nostril. <laughs> okay, okay, that looks better. Mm, what is this? Bridge nose. Okay, there. Mouth width. There. Jaw. 
mission. <laughs> okay, let's go for you. We're trying to look for a. We're going for a young guy. That's better, okay. Alright, body. Let's go for the body. Neck. We don't want too skinny, too low. About there. Shoulders. Uh, there we go. For about there. Uh, that looks good. Chest size. We want to look a bit tough there. Rib size. No, we don't want to make him too fat. Let's go about there. Actually, if I stomach size. <laughs> okay, that looks funny. He's not a guy who eats a lot. Um, let's go about there. Hip depth. Mm, let's keep it there. Next. Okay, he's not Slender Man, that's for sure. Let's keep him about there. Shoulder. There. Chest step. I think we'll just keep it there for now. Waist size. Hip size. There. Arms. Skinny, do you want them bulky? Do you want them eh, mid size? What's this? Oh, his arms. Let's go there. Hands. Uh, eh, I'll go for there. Hand scaling size. We don't want them too long. Fingertips. Eh, there. Leg length. Oh yeah, there we go. We can zoom out better. Okay. Uh, where were we? Leg length. There. Leg bulk, okay. Hmm, just keep that there. Arm bulk, oh, we did that already. That's this. Oh, his legs. We're trying to make him a slim young dude. That should be good. Let's do a spin around. That yeah, looks good. Looks nice. So he's gonna be six, six feet one inch. That's pretty tall. Yeah, body uniform. Let's go for a uniform. Loose jacket. Eh. Insignia, com badge, yeah, let's zoom in, let's see his com badge. And, mm, mm, mm. Next generation, Odyssey, motion pictures, science, operation into the Insignia, command, com badge. I think this one looks cool. Ensign. Hmm. Hmm. Hands. I think this looks good. Belt. Boots. I think we'll just leave it like that. Uniform. That's all we get. Oh, cool. We can change this. Hmm, well, looks better. So we went with golden on here, which is pretty good. 
incoming Cigna. We want this like gold silverish ensign. There. Gloves. Black looks good. I think that looks good. Just trying to make something match. That looks good. I think we keep it there. Outside, let's make an outside white. Pants, oh, this is interesting. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. No, I think we're gonna keep this one. Same color. good all right save outfit oh stance we gotta think of the stance standard brawler huh that looks good that looks very interesting jester no that looks like he's a old man gruff relaxed stern mm hmm swagger <laughs> thoughtful twitchy no, he looks like an android like that. Thoughtful. Swagger? It's either Swagger, Stern... Brawler... Swagger. Eh. No, Stern. Cancel Stern. Swagger... Or Brawler. I think I'll go for Swagger. We'll make him... 6-2. Save outfit. Sl okay, save outfit. Is that it? Okay, hairstyle. You gotta think of a hairstyle. Eh. Whoa, I've never seen a Vulcan like that. Eh. Yeah. 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 Is there more? Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. You know what, guys? I'm going to pause the video and I'm done clicking, changing the hairs. I'll start it. Alright, guys, so we chose the hairstyle and I changed my stance to Brawler. I changed the eye color to blue. Um, we're doing appearance right now, the facial. Um, do you want him to look like a white person? White, tan, uh, uh. I think we'll go for this color. That looks good on him. Next, background. No, this is background. This is for usually people who do a lot of role playing. Um, captain name. Hmm. Captain name. Let's see what's random. Ooh. 
Vomek, Vomek, Vomek. Names are very cheesy. So we pick a last name for him. His name is Vomek. Um, middle name. I'm not sure. I'm not gonna have to pause this video right here and choose a name. Um, yeah. So we chose Vomek. Um, we're not gonna go with middle or last name. Um, that's too hard. Um, sh ship name. USS. The USS. You know what? We're gonna go for the USS Data in honor of Data and for the lore. The USS Data lore. That sounds good. Uh, we're gonna have to do, we don't have to do biography, um, just more like for people who do role playing, lots of role playing. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do Engage. So, I'll see you once the thing starts. This is it guys, we engaged. Alright. This is it. Whoa. Vulcans! You gotta love Vulcans. I'm not sure what type of starship is After that. I left Starfleet, I made it my life's work to reunite the Romulans with their Vulcan brothers. For many years, I lived among them and waged the campaign of peace. Live long. Twenty-one years ago, the star of the Hobus system went supernova and sent a wave of devastation across the quadrant. I promised to save the Romulan homeworld. I failed. The planets Romulus and Remus were destroyed. Countless billions were killed. My home, my friends, my life, all are memories. Time does not stop for one man, and neither does history. The chaos in Romulan space gave the Klingon Empire an opportunity to expand its territory. Today, Jim Pak, the Chancellor of the High Council, traded diplomacy for the tip of a blade. Only in battle, Jim Pak says, is a Klingon truly Klingon. The Federation did its utmost to preserve its alliance with the Klingons, but war was inevitable. The Romulans want revenge for their lost world. The Dominion is rebuilding its forces. Who's Dominion? Now the Borg have reappeared, and the Alpha Quadrant balances on the edge of ruin. The fate of the galaxy rests in your hands. That was awesome. Um, right now, um, in honor of Leonard Nimoy, who passed away, I would like to take a moment of silence in honor of a great Star Trek character and actor. Rest in peace, Larry Nimoy. Alright, let's get started. Alright, welcome to Star Trek Online. Today is graduation day and you will soon be embarking on your trading Training Crusade. Cruise, cruise, whatever. Where the bulk of the ship is manned by cadets like yourself. This tutorial will introduce you to the basics, yada yada yada. Continue. Alright, can we move around? Oh, this is so cool. We can move. People you can interact with have icons above their heads. You can press the interaction key, default F, to talk with them. Finally, I was beginning to think you forgot what today was. How could I? You reminded me of every day, uh, okay. Of course, I was first in line. Oh, before I forget, I think Raski is just ahead. 
He wanted to thank you for helping him cram for the Astro. All right. Continue. Wow, this is so cool. This is so awesome. <laughs> it feels like I'm actually in Star Trek. All right. Um. This is very cool. Can we go a bit of exploring first? See my stance. All right, let's keep going. Ew. <laughs> um, class of 2000, 2409. That's like years ahead of us. Hmm. Nice sprint. Oh, there we go. Shift to sprint. Interact. There you are. I wanted to thank you for helping me pass that final, and for all the other times you've helped me. I've always admired you. I hope Starfleet recognizes all you've done to lead our class. What ship did you get? I haven't received my assignment yet. Good luck. Before you report to Lieutenant Farron, get your assignment. You should find Tavral. She wanted to talk to you. She's just up the pathway. Why are you more higher rank than I am if you were in my class and I graduated? I don't know. You know what? I am going to take a screenshot. Let's see, where can I stand to take a screenshot? I'll stand right here. Let's turn around. Da da da. No, wait, I can't. What? I can't. What? Is there a way, some way I can turn around without myself moving? I don't think I can. Oh well. Um. Cadet something. Ah, that cadet. That one. Wait, which one could it? That could it? Greetings. Okay. Oh, are you a Vulcan like me? It was good of you to encourage me to retake the linguistics final. I was willing to accept my original results, but you saw that I was not at my best that day. My score increased by 12.8% on the second attempt, well within my standard norms. Now I am qualified to serve as both a science officer and a communications officer. Morik would like to see you as well. He is ahead of us on the path. Live long and prosper. Live long and prosper to you, too. Your mini-map shows you where your objectives are. An arrow will appear on the mini-map if you are far away from your objective. That lady who's speaking sounds a lot like the lady who does the Nancy Drew games. There you are! Getting excited yet? Once we finish our training crews, we'll all be full-fledged ensigns. The buzz is... Captain Taggart hasn't named all of his senior staff yet. From what I heard, the advanced phaser training simulation is tripping people up. Thanks. All right, we go to him. Good afternoon, Cadet. Whoa, is that a what wolf? What can I do for you? Or a dog? Or a I have no idea. Is this is where is this where I get my training course assignment? Yes. I have the complete assignment list here. Name? Name? Vomek. Let's At least see. I'm saying it right. Interesting. Is there a Report? problem? You're going to have to ask him. Continue. The direction of your objectives also appears on your compass. Yeah. 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 Where am I going? Where do I go? Who do I go to? Nope. Here. Objects you can interact with have a glow around them. Press F to interact with a doorbell to notify Captain Taggart of your presence. Come. Come. I have that ringtone, by the way. Cadet. Yes, I did. sir. I've been following your progress here at the Academy, and I must say, I'm impressed. Thank you, Captain. I'm just looking at your final test scores. 
But I don't see your results for the advanced phase of training program. I'm not a tactical officer, sir. I concentrated on courses from my career track. Many of my classes didn't take the test either. Captain, is that an issue? Ah, da 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 da. This one. I want everyone on my senior staff to run that program. And I want to see good results, no exceptions. Did you say senior staff? I'll tell Flores to meet you out in the quad. Talk to her to start the phaser training, and I'll see you when you're finished. Yes, sir. <laughs> I did a salute there. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Alright, let's keep going. I wonder if that gardener is still here. The gardener who's in all the episodes of Star Trek. I got the tactical officer spot. Just what I wanted. Where'd you end up? You never did that? I thought you were Mr. Extra Credit. Everyone knows that Captain Taggart expects all his top people to pass that program. Now you tell me. Don't worry, you'll do fine. Come on, I'll take you to the holodeck and set it up. Lead the way. Seems most of our class ended up on Captain Taggart's ship. Kishjir here at Starfleet Academy. To sprint, tap the shift key while moving. Yes, I know. Last one of the console buys the first round tonight. Yeah, you say that after you start running. <sighs> Setting up the training program now. I hope Holodeck 2 is your lucky Holodeck. I'll need a phaser. Phasers are in the lockers by the Holodecks. You can grab one there. Let's go. Press the V key to scan the area. Your tricorder will point you toward your nearest objective. Standing all cool, all the deck too, right? Yeah. Wow, this holiday looks exactly the way it looks in the episodes. Begin program. Whoa. Now what? One. Okay. What do we do now? In combat, right click on a target to fire your weapon. Oh, Klingons. While in combat, certain actions are disabled. Once you drop out of combat, more detail about ground combat will become available. and draw your weapon with the H key. Well done, cadet. You're not going to break the Academy record, but your score was more than satisfactory. Thank you, Captain. Do you have any assignments for me now? Absolutely. I have a new first officer. Congratulations. First officer, sir? Yes. You should be proud of your accomplishments here, cadet. You have a promising career ahead of you in Starfleet. Thank you, sir. It's, it will be an honor serving with you. First officer, way to go. Just a little jealous, I'll admit. <laughs> At least now you'll get to boss us all around like you've always wanted. I think you should start referring to me as sir. It's a long... I think I'll go with this one. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. May I get you a rack to Gino, <laughs> sir? <laughs> you'll do great. But we should head up to the shuttle bay. Everyone else is waiting there for the ceremonial send-off toast. Continue. The direction of your objective Let's go. also appears on your compass. Now 
hear this. All cadets report to shuttle bay to prepare for departure. This looks so awesome. I mean, look at this uniform texture. I don't know how good it's going to be on video, but I mean, wow. Hello, Walken. Where is it? I think I took a wrong turn somewhere. <laughs> First day of graduation, I'm lost. <laughs> Shouldn't I know this place like the back of my hand? Nope. That's not it. Nah. Yeah. Nope. Maybe back in here. Oh, wait. There. Where'd you go? Ah, turbo lift. Let's head over there. Right now. Yeah, yeah, didn't wait for you. All you just the senior there. staff is waiting by the bar. I know Vulcans don't get nervous, but the rest of us do. And this is our first real assignment. So I'm expecting an inspiring speech out of you. Something heartwarming, something... Okay, just don't scare anyone. This mission could just determine the rest of our careers. No pressure. I'll meet you over there. Alrighty. Eh, don't worry. No sweat. She said Vulcans don't get nervous. Lead a toast. May I get everyone's may I have everyone's attention? Begin your speech. You can read that. Continue to do the harden the cadets. I gotta board the shuttle. Talk to you guys later. Are you ready to head to the ship? Dude, you really need some plastic surgery. Let's go! Oh my gosh, this is so awesome! Docking bay. I think it is a docking bay. I can't believe we're finally doing this. Oh, look at that. Yeah, look at that. Wow. The USS Vesta, first of her class. She's got subsystem targeting, a crew of 750, auxiliary phaser cannons, and even a quantum field focus controller. I can't wait to captain one someday. But here's our ship. <laughs> okay, that We're got me there. Class, 200 crew, two forward weapon mounts, one aft. Average speed, warp, five point nothing. <laughs> She's a tough little <laughs> ship, though. I think I like her. I want the other ship. We're the final shuttle to arrive. We need to get to the bridge. Yeah, we sure do need to get to the bridge. Alright guys, thank you for watching, um, stay tuned for part 2, um, as I said I'll be doing some walk, pl game, let's plays, not walkthroughs, let's plays through the whole game up to level 6, like the whole story content, so, yeah, that was just the intro, thank you for watching, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and subscribe, yeah, rate, comment, subscribe, and, yeah, peace out.